Welcome back to our channel and another vacation vlog. <laughs> we are heading to Galveston, but we're making a stop on our way down. Stay tuned. It'll be a surprise. You see where we're going to go. Got Ryan with us. We got everything packed up in the back here. All kinds of stuff. Crazy. I go from one beach to another beach. <laughs> Lucky you. I go from a cold beach to a warm beach. Yeah. You excited? That's the best beach, the warm beach. Yeah. <laughs> we are swimming out of out of uh, Dallas Fort Worth on our way to Houston and then to Galveston, and the rain is just getting harder and harder. You can hear it. You can probably see it. It's hard to see the road on the road. Wow. Well, Cheryl was right, sort of. We haven't even got to Corsicana yet, but the rain is letting up, so it looks promising. It was coming down super hard, but now it's starting to stop. Yeah, Cheryl's driving. Hey guys. Ah! And it's raining hard again. You probably can't hear me very well because of all the rain hitting the car. It's massive. We're about an hour away from Houston. We thought that we were out of it, but apparently there's another line of uh, rain that's coming through, so we'll see how long it lasts. Yeah, so we went from going 75 to almost 45 miles per hour. We're taking it slow and we're going to be safe. Just yeah. Down. yeah, we want to be safe. We're hungry for lunch. We were gonna go to Friday's and we saw Chewy's, so might as well go to Chewy's and get some tacos, Mexican food. Yeah, so it was an audible. We changed the play. We're going to Friday's, changed it to Chewy's, so now we're like a couple minutes away. And then we're heading to the surprise, so stay tuned. I can't wait to get there. It's more for Ryan than it is for us, but we're excited to do it as well. Late lunch was delicious. <coughs> it was good. We're stuffed now. We're good until dinner time. But we've come to the realization that where we want to go closes in two hours. And it will take us an hour and a half to get there from where we are right now. We are <laughs> sad, but we're going to hit it on our way home on Thursday. So, so you, you still have to wait to figure out what it is. Yeah, you still have to wait for the surprise. Later in the video. <laughs> we didn't leave the house on time this morning, and also all of this crazy rain that we went through off and on. Oh my gosh, it was not fun. It slowed us down. Yeah. So, you'll just have to wait. Mountain line of cars. Finally, we get to leave Chewy's and get on the road. That was crazy. We got Rosa, our navigation, telling us where to go. So we're heading to the beach house, you guys. We have about an hour and a half more drive to the condo, our condo rental. I'll give you guys a tour when we get there. We made it to Galveston. Yeah, look at these guys, SpongeBob and Scooby-Doo. Oh, that across. is so you don't see that funny. There they are. They're going to the ocean. They got a freaking pool. A blow up pool. Oh my gosh. They're probably going to make it to or try to do a raft or something. I don't that know. That is funny. Yeah. yeah. You definitely don't see There's that. There's the day. water, guys. We have about a five minute drive down the seawall here. 
here's just a quick look at what the condo lobby looks like. There's some chairs and couches, coffee maker, restrooms. Just a nice area to come through. I always, always have to mess with Ryan. He's like, Mom, you're silly. And Steve is checking us in. We're here. <laughs> we are. It's nice. We're glad to finally be in Galveston. Now we just have to unpack the SUV and bring everything up here. Yeah. So I'm going to give you guys a tour right now of the condo. And then we're going to go down and get all our stuff because we've got a lot of stuff to bring up. Yeah, we do. A lot. We'll show you. This is our view from our balcony. Isn't it awesome? Every morning waking up to that. This is our patio furniture. I just wish they had cushions to go on them. Our spacious kitchen had everything that we needed. A nice size TV, a couple of chairs, nice couch for all of us, and a couple of coffee tables. Ryan definitely made himself at home very quickly on that couch. Bunk beds, Ryan slept on the bottom bunk and it was very comfortable. Each night he got great rest. Here is Steve and I's king size bed. And we also had a TV in there as well. And just some decorations in the hallway. All right, this is all the loot that we brought with us. So we're gonna bring most of this up to our condo, but we're gonna leave like the chairs in here and the boogie boards and any other things that are just beach related. Why do you have a shopping cart, honey? It was up here on the third floor. I'm gonna use it to bring our stuff up. <laughs> We're gonna load this baby up. Yeah, but you notice this shopping cart is probably not like shopping carts you have because it's plastic. And the reason it's plastic is because if it was metal, it would rust. Got everything in the cart. Good job. Yeah. All right, Steve is gonna unload our cart. And there is another plastic shopping cart and another hotel cart down there. How random is that? They're just hanging out there. I think people just left them there and didn't take them downstairs. All right, Ryan just had a bloody nose, but he's doing a little bit better now. And I packed the cooler full of food for breakfast and lunches. So I'm going to empty this and put everything away. All right, you guys, we got all unpacked, situated. We got to take a little bit of a rest connect our phones to the Wi-Fi, figure out how to work the TV, and just look around and check everything out and see what our amenities were. We really like it. We have stayed at this condo complex last year, but we were on the other side, and we were on the second floor. This time we're on the third floor, and we're in the very, very front, and Steve just loves our views, so do I. But when Steve opened up that door, man, he beelined it to the back porch. And he was like, look at this view. Um, so Ryan wanted to stay home just in case his bloody nose starts up again. Hopefully it'll be okay. And Steve and I are just taking a quick trip down to the local public access beach here. We're going to beach comb a little bit and check out the beach. This is one of our favorite spots to go to. I don't think this is. All right, that was the wrong turn. I think <laughs> it's a little bit further down the road. It's been a year. It's, it's, uh, <laughs> we'll find it. <laughs> so we are down at the beach and it is so awesome. It's, it's perfect weather. It's, the water is great. It's just nice temp cannot complain so looking forward to the next three days here at the beach yeah we're looking for seashells yeah and we already got a little stash going on in the bag so we'll bit. show them what we find when we get back to the condo yeah find some good treasures that's what we're looking for yeah doesn't the water feel good it's great 
It went out. Why'd it go out? It gotta come back in for us. Low tide. Yeah, it's low tide, you guys. But that means we can find stuff. Here's a seashell. Yeah. This is a pretty one. Ooh, we gotta add that to the stash. The water feels so good. It's so warm, you guys. The water here. further down the beach and I'm like, I think it's a piece of seaweed. I walk over it and it's a huge shell, beautiful, all intact. And uh, that's the kind of things that we love to find. We haven't even been out here for 30 minutes. Dinner for tonight at the beach condo is pigs in a blanket and some crinkle cut fries. Brought some mustard and ketchup. This will pretty much be the only dinner that we're eating in on vacation. Otherwise, every night we're gonna be eating out. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be nice. So, we are done. I mean, this is pretty much the end of our Sunday, which was the travel day here. We already got to go to the beach, as you saw, so lots of fun. And we're gonna relax, enjoy the rest of the night after we have dinner, and then you guys can see what we do tomorrow. We're not exactly sure what that's gonna be yet, but stay tuned and find out. Thanks for watching our first night, and we hope that you stay tuned to find out what happens tomorrow.